What's good? It's Chigozi. It's Tuesday, November 6, 2018, and the Ohio gubernatorial election 2018 is today. This is a theatrical sporting event from the Scottish Rite Foundations from the federal government. It involves two paid deceivers, two paid actors acting like they're running to be the next governor, replacing John Kasich. I'm going to show you how these people are going to be installed by the numbers. I want to do a more comprehensive video later on, but right now this video is only going to show you that from their birthday to the day of the event has the number of Ohio, and for Mike DeWine, it's from both ways. You get the number from Ohio. Just more evidence showing you how it's always scripted theatrical event. These are two actors. The entire election process is complete bullshit. If you vote in the state of Ohio, it's because you are retarded and you do not see the truth in front of you. Mike DeWine, you know, first click on this dude, see his name. First off, I want to point out, his name is Mike. He's running to be the 70th governor of Ohio. Because right now, John Kasich is the 69th. So, we have the 69th governor who's right now in office, John Kasich. These people are running to replace him to be the 70th. So, we have Mike, 70. You know, very fitting if he wins. Be the next governor, you know, another Republican governor in the state of Ohio. The state of Ohio is just another Zionist Jew territory playing the role of some Republican state. I don't care if they say it's borderline state or whatever they use the term they use. No, I mean, we have John Kasich's ass here. Donald Trump's always coming here. This is a Republican state filled with Republican morons. And all the Democrats here are retarded as fuck, too, so it doesn't matter. All divide and conquer from the Zionist Jew bankers. So today to his upcoming birthday, January 5th, 2019, he's going to be 72. And right now he's 71. Catholic 71, Buckeye 72. So from today, the election day, to his upcoming birthday, is 61 days. 61. That is the number for Ohio. Ohio equals 61, reversed in the alphabetical order. So A is 26, Z is 1 in this cipher. Add the corresponding values together, you get 61. The numbers for time, time equals 61. In the satanic cipher, time also equals 187, like Society of Jesus, like the 1870 date on the Ohio State's emblem. Time 187, Ohio 187. So I'm showing you this number. Keep this number in mind. So Mike DeWine, born January 5th, 1947. Again, Time 47, Ohio 47. Born 1 slash 5 and 47. 47 is the 15th prime number. You see how he's just an actor playing the role of the number 47. Very well. Such a nice connection in his birthday alone. Makes me think he could be the governor of Ohio. Yeah, so far in my preliminary decode, because again, this is no different than decoding a sporting event. It is the same exact thing. This is a sports game. Two actors, just this case, they're not athletic. Only difference is that they're not athletic, but it's the same exact thing, scripted by the same exact gang. John Kasich's employers, which are the Zionist Jews, the Freemasons, the Jesuit Order, they run the state of Ohio, they do it all by the numbers. January 5th, well, so we'll see from his... 71st birthday, which was this year, to today, this election day. It is 305 days, kind of the end date, is a span of 306 days. Buckeye, 36. So we have Ohio from his upcoming birthday, Buckeye from his past birthday. The same pattern in all of Ohio's propaganda So, there's always plenty more here, but I just want to point out those Ohio-specific connections. Now we'll see Richard Cordray. And you know, if I did more research on this, and I still might be able to today, but like, back test it. See how many days from John Kasich's birthday was his election and things like that. So, Richard Cordray, he's the Democratic actor trying to be the next governor of Ohio. And guys, I'm telling you right now, if he wins, it does not matter. The state of Ohio is still going to be some bullshit police state. Still going to be tyrannized. Still going to overtax you. Still going to be the same exact bullshit place. 
in the United States of America. It does not matter who your governor is. They answer, they take orders from the Jewish bankers who run the federal government. So, born May 3rd, that's 3 slash 5. Just like how 305 days from Mike DeWine's birthday is the election, he's now born 3 slash 5, Catholic 35, Philema 35. But more importantly, he's born 5 slash 3. Ohio equals 16, the 15th prime, excuse me, 53 is the 16th prime number. So 53 is the 16th prime number, Ohio equals 16, and here this guy's born 5 slash 3, not Mike DeWine, but Richard Cordray. Also, I want to point this out too, I'm just pointing out everything I can before, before, it's, before you know, anything's too late or whatever, just while I can. But his name is Richard Michael DeWine. You know, Michael, another 33 name. So do you know why both men running for the governor position of Ohio, both named Richard? We have Richard Michael DeWine. We have Richard Cordray. Richard equals 61, like Ohio, 47, like Ohio, running to be Ohio's governor because this is fake news propaganda. They're two actors for the Scottish Rite Freemasons. They are two paid stage performers, two performing artists for the Zionist Jews, the Jesuit order, the Masonic order within the Catholic Church. Again, 61 days from Mike DeWine's birthday, Richard 61, Ohio 61. So Richard Adams Cordray, May 3rd, 1959, to election day. So it's his birthday from this year. Right now, he is 59, born in 59. 59 is the 17th prime. Ohio is the 17th state. Time equals 20. 71 is the 21st prime. That's why Mike DeWine is 71. But we'll, we'll look at the 59-year-old actor, you know, from Mason 59. From his 59th birthday to this event is exactly 187 days you see this and we talked about this earlier time equals 187 ohio equals 187 i said keep that in mind you know society of jesus 187 special number two the state of ohio as i've been showing the state of ohio does a lot of propaganda by this number and now we see how it's 187 days from his birthday richard quarter the democrat he's running for this position also span of 188 the Illuminati 188 also six months three days 63, like Columbus, Ohio, like the key of David, like the reflection of 36, Buckeye 36. Columbus also equals 47. Columbus, Ohio, with a double 63, you know, the key of David pattern, the key of David, the key of David, 135, 63, 63. So, and then now remember too, see how Columbus, Ohio sums to 171, that's a reshuffling of 117. Buckeye equals 117 in the Jewish cipher. Ohio equals 117. So tomorrow, November 7th, 11 slash 7, it's a date with a lifeless number of 29. Ohio equals 29. It's a date with 47 numerology. Ohio equals 47. Time equals 20. Ohio loves doing things by the number of 20 as well. 311th day of the year, Thelema 64. 311 to 64th prime, synagogue of Satan 64. Catholic 46, the numbers for Thelema paired with 54, Sun 54, so we have the Saturnian Sun connection with Ohio, the Keeper of Time, Saturn the Keeper of Time, Buckeye equals 36. What I'm trying to say is the state of Ohio is going to have some propping in tomorrow. It can either be announcing the winners, it's going to be some major news event, something big that they're going to do by these numbers. It's a very ripe day for the state of Ohio. I can't imagine how on 117... 36, again, Buckeye, Ohio numbers, perfect inside the date numerology of Sun 18, Society of Jesus 56, Scottish 113, the reflection of 311, it's just perfect day for the Masonic state of Ohio. So I'm glad I at least let you know about that, I can't wait to see what happens tomorrow. So far I'm like 100% correct in saying Ohio's going to put propaganda more this day than they do. Ohio 61, you know, 61 to 38 minority. But we're going to do it from, so from 
today to Richard Cordry's upcoming birthday. There wasn't any Ohio number. And I don't want to say this because there was two Ohio numbers from Mike DeWine means he's going to win. Although just other things I saw, you know, Mike 70, going to be the 70th governor. There's more research I want to do. But this is just from today to Richard Cordray, the Democratic nominee's upcoming birthday. A span of 179 days. That's the 41st prime, 41 to 13th prime, 253 weeks, 25 weeks and three days. The sum of the numbers 1 through 22 gives you 253. Time equals 254. So does light in the English extended cipher. Here we have 25 weeks and four days from Cordray's upcoming birthday. We get the numbers for time and light. And it's very fitting because, again, this is you see how I typed in time, nothing changed. Ohio sums to 25 also when you reverse and reduce once because H is 19. 1 plus 9 is 10. H is 19 when you reverse. So you see how time went 254, you know, light. And then here we have 254 from Richard Cordray's upcoming birthday, 25 weeks and four days, participating in this propaganda. If you go and vote, you're wasting your time, you're retarded. Cordray 84. This is 8 and 4 from Mike DeWine's birthday. When I did a, when I did a span of 61 days, that was what, like 8 weeks and 4 days without Canada end date. Masonry 84, Zionism 84, Jesuit 84, Masonry 105, Masonry 42, Masonry 39. I mean, this guy is a Freemason. His name and Masonry at the same. Gematria, a federal 51, reflection of 105, 33, 39. This is federal government propaganda. You have to understand, Richard Cordray, John Kasich, Mike DeWine, they are actors for the federal government. This is not some state level, you know, independent. No, this is federal run propaganda this is a federal run theatrical event with two federal government actors i also did it from john Kasich's birthday for, for them i saw some things i might have to do it this evening because i really got to end this video now but i just want to show you what i can get off from the top of my head but then here's you know more homework you could just do from john Kasich's birthday and sync him up with these people see how he got elected and well Installed, you know, these people are never elected. They're installed by the Freemasons. Always the numbers for Skytrack Freemasonry, all over John Kasich's propaganda. He is a Skytrack Freemason for the state of Ohio. So there you have it. Both two Richards running for president. Now you see why. It's not a coincidence. This is fake news propaganda. You saw how from both their birthdays we get the numbers for Ohio. You know, Catholic 145. So, just one last thing. Just get some of the named Gematria out there into the world, you know what I mean? Mike DeWine, 53, running against the guy born 5 slash 3. Israel, 98. Mike DeWine, I think they said he was raised Catholic, you know? Another Catholic actor. Also very well, a Zionist Jew, too. A crypto Jew. I'm sure this, I'm sure Mike DeWine's the biggest crypto Jew in the state of Ohio. You probably bet me on that. Richard Michael DeWine, 109, the 29th prime, Ohio 29. 11 slash 6. One slash, see, that's what I'm saying. Like, a lot of things sync up for him. 116. And his name sums to that. And the elections are on 1, 1 slash 6. Just like how Donald equals 119, elected on 11 slash 9. So you see the pattern now? This guy wins. He wins Ohio's governorship. 109, the 29th prime, Ohio 29. Name sums to 116 on 11 slash 6. I'm so glad I showed you that because I remember seeing that and I would regret not talking about that. You know, I really used, like to use the word regret, but you know what I mean. Really good example. Governor. Equals 51, 39. See, so, you, know, you gotta watch out then. Cordray, you know, 39, like governor, 105. But he's running to be governor. It could go either way. But so far, Mike DeWine's my pick. <laughs> and if you're new here, no, it's not because I like his policies and what he's about and I want him to win because I don't want any of these actors to win. I don't give a fuck about any of these people. They're deceivers. 
There are Zionist Jew deceivers, Freemasons, Jesuits, putting on plays, leading you down the path of the agenda. Why, don't, why do I want any of these people in? No, I'm just trying to say, based on what I've seen so far, it looks like a stronger narrative for Mike DeWine, but I need to do more research. But I'm just saying if he wins, I'm saying it here. But it doesn't matter who wins. You see how they're both coded with the numbers for Ohio. It's a, all a joke. These are two actors participating in some fake news propaganda. Today's date numerology, 35. You know, his name comes to 53. We've been seeing a lot of 35s. 305 days from his from Mike DeWine's birthday is this election. Catholic 55, 46. You know, the Catholic Church going to be in some propaganda today. Space 1728, look up for that today as well. Assassination 611 in Jewish Gematria, killed 28. Chaos 1946, Catholic, NASA 35. NASA should put out some property, I really think so, and the Catholic Church, but peace out, take care.